Wednesday Children's Church for Sunday, January 17th. We're going to start off by singing Our God is So Big. We're going to be a cheetah, so you can run really fast. And then we're going to be an inchworm. Ma, ma, ma. And since it's winter, we'll be a penguin. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. He made the stars, he made the seas, he made the cheetahs too. Rawr! My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. He made the stars, he made the seas, he made the inchworms too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. He made the stars, he made the seas, he made the penguins too. My God is so big, so strong and so mighty, there's nothing my God cannot do. He's got the whole world in his hands, he's got the whole world. In his hands, he's got the whole world. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got you and me, brother. In his hands, he's got you and me, brother. In his hands, he's got you and me, brother. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got you and me, sister. In his hands, he's got you and me, sister. In his hands, he's got you and me, sister. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world. In his hands, he's got the whole world. In his hands, he's got the whole world. In his hands, he's got the whole world in his hands. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. We sing the song to get ready to listen to a story of God. When we're together, we sit cross applesauce, hands in our laps, our mouths are closed and still, our ears are open and listening, and our eyes are open and watching. I wonder if this is a parable. Hmm, it might be. Parables are very precious, like gold. And this box is gold. This looks like a present. Well, parables are like presents. You can't buy them or take them or steal them. They have already been given to us. There's another reason this might be a parable. It has a lid. And sometimes parables seem to have lids on them. But when you open them up, there's something very precious inside. I know. Let's take a look and see if there's something in here that will tell us if it's a parable. Hmm. I wonder what this could be. It is the color yellow. I wonder what could be so yellow. It could be the sun or a big yellow ball. Why is 
once there was someone who said such amazing things and did such wonderful things that people began to follow him. As they followed, he told them about a place called the kingdom of heaven. But they did not understand. They had never been to such a place and they didn't know anyone who had. They didn't even know where it was. So one day they simply had to ask him, what is the kingdom of heaven like? And he said, the kingdom of heaven is like the grain of a mustard seed, which a person took and sowed into a field. It is the smallest of seeds. And it grew and it grew and it grew and it grew and it grew, and it grew until it was the tallest and biggest of all the shrubs. And it becomes a tree. So that birds of the air come. And make their nest there. Birds have names. I wonder how these birds feel about this tree. I wonder where the birds are coming from. I wonder if the birds were happy to find such a tree. birds could really live in this tree. I wonder if this tree has a name. I wonder if this tree could be put back into the seed after it has grown. I wonder where this tree might really be. I wonder where this whole place might really be. We light the Christ candle to remind us that Jesus is with us as we hear the word of God. Our story today comes from the book of Matthew, chapter 13, verses 31 through 32. He told them another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed, which a man took and planted in the field. Though it is the smallest of all your seeds, yet when it grows, it is the largest of garden plants and becomes a tree, so that the birds of the air can come and perch in its branches. It is now time to give our thanks to God. You can say something you're thankful for about for this story or something you're thankful for that happened this week. If you're worried or sad or scared about something, you can pray about that too. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. 
It is right to give our thanks and praise. Let us pray. God, thank you for small seeds and big seeds and all seeds that grow into wonderful flowers and beautiful trees and life-giving plants. Help us to be like those plants and to give life to others. Thank you for the winter that although things are not growing, there are th still things getting ready to grow. Help us to get ready to grow. Thank you for all the people who have really hard jobs right now. Protect them and help them to make good choices and to be safe. Help those who are sick in mind, in body, or in spirit and help us to love them as you love them. Amen. I am now going to change the light. Look, the light is in one place at one time but I'm gonna change it so it is in many places at many times. The light that was just in one place at one time is now in many places at many times. So the light and the love of Jesus may be with you as you watch this video and everywhere you go throughout the week.